Hey YouTubers, well here we go again, another review uh, with uh, Bang Energy Drink. Is it just another energy drink loaded with sugar and a ton of caffeine? Or is it an actual semi-healthy energy drink that has good ingredients for you, which is Ultra CoQ10, which is good for the bloodstream, good for the heart. BCA Aminos, which is good for muscle recovery if you're into fitness and working out. And then Super Creatine, which is also another really good ingredient for you. Um, zero sugars, uh, zero caffeine, and zero calories per can. Um... I got tired of the four hour crash from uh, drinking Monster, so I quit drinking Monster because I just did not look forward to that four hour crash after drinking it. Uh, so then I switched over to Rockstar, which is also loaded with caffeine and sugar, just an overdose of caffeine and sugar, which is not good for your body, not good for anything in particular, unless you want to just get dehydrated really fast and get all jittery and whatnot, whatever these energy drinks do to your body, everyone's different, so they affect people differently. Then I happened to discover Bang, and yeah, they had me with the first can I had, pretty much. Not only is it body feel, well, it's brain feel as well. Um, I got a few guys at work hooked on this drink now. They're all into drinking rock stars, monsters, we have a guy at work that drinks uh, one or two monsters a night. Sometimes the big 20 ounce Red Bull, which he's paying five bucks a can for that 20 ounce Red Bull. Um, and Red Bulls are expensive just in general. Even a eight ounce can is going to cost you three or four bucks for a can of Red Bull. Uh, however, Bang is not overpriced and they don't skip on ingredients. It's line priced with Monster, line priced with Rockstar. Um, so you could get them at a really good price, especially if you're like me and you just start buying them by the case. Uh, my local Chevron where I found them, a huge display of them. 7-Eleven uh, started selling them, so you can find them at 7-Eleven. Chevron's now, at least my local Chevron now has them. And that's where I picked them up. One of my coworkers asked me to pick them up a case of it. And so I did, and these are the two flavors I got him, Black Cherry Vanilla, which I've had, and also Sour Heads, which I've had, and they're both really good flavors. And the one I am about to have right before I start my work day here is Cherry Blade Lemonade, which is a really good flavor. I have a case of that for myself at the house, and this flavor is also really good. So they have so many different flavors to choose from, from champagne to cotton candy to root beer. I heard the root beer one is pretty good too, which I definitely want to try that one. If you like cotton candy, that is not a bad flavor to pick up. So far, um, one of the flavors that I really like as well is the peach mango. That one is really good. Um, the blueberry raz, I have a coworker that loves that flavor. But like I said, three or four of my buddies here at work are now hooked on them. Now they come in with these instead of their Monsters and Red Bulls that they've been coming in with or their rock stars. So my buddy looked at me. He's like, you're drinking that now? I said, yes, you got to try one. So I gave him a can. Then on his lunch break, he went to 7-Eleven and picked up another can for himself. So yeah, I got a few guys at work hooked on them. And I am about to pour mine over ice right now, although I had it in the freezer before I started, before I left the house for work today. But I'm just gonna pour it right into my Yeti mug here, right over some ice where it's gonna stay nice and cold to where I don't have to pound the entire can, although it's not bad to pound when it's ice cold. So, and my Yeti, It'll hold the ice for hours on end. And here's my cool little logo on my Yeti. Although Yeti is supposedly uh, protesting the Second Amendment or whatever the hell they're doing. But 
Anyways, that's a different story, but Bang Energy Drink is a very good energy drink. My buddies at work said it does not make them jittery, and they don't get that four-hour crash that they get from uh, Monster and Rockstar and some of the other energy drink companies. When I saw this one first on the market, I was like, oh, look, another new energy drink, but then I tasted it and i was really impressed it really gets me to focus at work it actually that pump and brain fuel it's brain and body fuel so it is not just stuff they're throwing on their can to sell the product this product actually works whether you're into fitness or you have a busy work lifestyle like me but i'm also into fitness i'm into bike riding and all that good stuff so those are my display a uh, bang it just fell over in my car Good thing they are not opened up. Uh, this is my buddy's case that I'm getting for him, actually. So, anyways, just wanted to give you a quick review on this excellent energy drink that is taking the market by storm. Um, they plan to exceed Monster and Rockstar sales, which I would not be surprised if they do with how much hype this drink is getting and how effective it is very good energy drink good ingredients put good in get good out um, your tongue will be happy your body will be happy once you try it give it a try if you don't like it hey I'll buy the rest of your bang off of you so anyways here it is from bang hope you enjoy the video let me know what you think post a comment post a review or even let me know if there's a flavor you don't like so I don't happen to buy a flavor and not like it. The Sour Heads one is really good, by the way. I've had it, and it's actually really, really good. So I heard the root beer flavor was a little on the sweet side, but I'm still willing to try it. Last time I went to my Chevron, they were already out of the root beer flavor, so they only had a couple cases of it in. But maybe, hey, you know, hopefully we could get it in our gun shop to sell as well. I would love to have this energy drink in our gun shop to sell to our customers. Have a little refrigerator in there with some bang in it. Not a bad way to keep our customers around longer, and they can loiter around the shop all day if they like. Well, hope you enjoy the video. Let me know what you think. Let me know what flavors you do and don't like, because I am definitely into trying all their flavors. Also, their champagne. I heard that one is also really good, too which I am going to try later this week. Well, enjoy the video. We'll see you on the next one.